today we'll bring a bit of Sicily home with a panelle, tasty chickpea fritters. Let's make them together. Ingredients for 10 servings. Five and a third cups of chickpea flour, three pints of water, half a tablespoon of salt, two and a half tablespoons of chopped parsley, 10 sesame seed buns, vegetable oil as needed, pepper to taste. You'll also need 50 plastic plates. Pour the cold water into a large saucepan. And sift in the chickpea flour. Then stir vigorously with a wire whisk to avoid any lumps. Make sure you're using cold water, otherwise it will go lumpy. Continue to stir and sift in the flour. When the mixture is smooth, with no lumps, turn on the heat to medium, add salt and pepper and bring to a boil, stirring constantly. As you can see, the mixture is simmering. It's critical that you keep stirring vigorously to keep it from sticking to the pan and forming lumps. If there are any lumps, you can use an immersion blender, but reduce the heat to low. It will take at least 10 minutes from the time it boils. The chickpea mixture is ready. Now remove from the heat and add the parsley. Stir and begin to shape the panelle. In Sicily, these fritters are spread onto wooden rectangles, but we can use small plastic plates about four, four and a half inches in diameter. We'll spread a small amount of the mixture onto each plate to a thickness of about one fifth, one tenth of an inch. When the parsley has been incorporated, I suggest that you place cling film in direct contact with the mixture because it hardens as it cools, making it difficult to spread. So take a spoonful of the mixture and spread onto a plate. Create a thin layer without making holes. If the mixture has hardened too much and it's not spreadable, you can cut into pieces and fry. As you can see, all the mixture has been spread onto the plates, so now let it cool and set for about 30 minutes until you can peel it off the plate. The panelle have cooled and separate easily from the plate. So fry in plenty of vegetable oil, I am using peanut oil, until nice and golden brown. Then drain and place on kitchen paper. The panelle are done. Keep in mind that it's a Sicilian street food traditionally served in round or oval sesame seed buns. So, fill the buns with your chickpea fritters and remember that if you have any leftover mixture or it has hardened too much, you can press into a baking pan, cut into slices or squares, fry and serve as a snack. 
from Sonia and Gelo Zafferano. Bye bye, enjoy your panelle and see you next video recipe.